The man to watch. In fantastic form and leading the competition in goals. Stay with us on EA TV. And a warm welcome on what is an ideal night for football, you've got to say. I'm Derek Ray, your match commentator, and alongside providing all the tactical and technical analysis, it's Stuart Robson. And a lot on the line, it's the playoff semi-final first leg coming up. It's Kerala Blasters, and they take on FC Goa. Well, Derek, this should be a closely fought tie between two teams who have performed really well all season. I'm expecting a really good tactical battle in this first leg with both coaches trying to gain that advantage going into the second leg. I think it will be a really close contest. The lineup then for the hosts. Well, in this shape, if their wide players stay high up the pitch and get enough for the ball, it's a very attacking lineup. But if they drop too deep, they will then leave the centre forward isolated and it could be difficult for them. This is how the visitors will set up today. Well, they're playing the same shape, really. So it's all about getting control of that central area. And which of the wide players has the greatest effect on the game? And so the battle commences. Alvaro. And a creative look about this. He's protecting it effectively. Options in the middle. Is it going to be an opportunity? It has gone over the touchline for what will be a throw-in. Options in the centre. And a really single-minded piece of defending to make sure nothing untoward happened. And the press is on and cleared away and the referee takes exception to the challenge free kick well who will be the player to decide the outcome to determine the course of events no reason at all why it won't be this man Stuart what do you anticipate seeing from him well what a goal scorer he is his finishing is so calm and composed which added to his skill makes him a top-class striker he'll certainly be hard to stop today And he's in. They had to react and did. And in with a real chance. And there it is. The first goal in the semi final. A huge moment. Extraordinary scenes. Well, here's another look, and you can see what a good finish this is. He holds off the defender brilliantly and keeps his composure. That's a great goal. So the ball rolling again with the scoreline standing at 1 0.
And back now with Ferreira. Physically strong and secure on the ball. And possession given away. Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. Good-looking sequence. And that is offside. Janu. Can he take the chance? It's in. They're looking really relaxed and confident and not giving the opposition much of a look in. Well, here we can see it again, and he does so well to skip beyond the defender. It just buys him that bit of time to get his shot away. That's a really nice goal. Two nil now, and back underway. We're getting the ball forward. Opportunity to deliver the cross. Well, couldn't find a teammate, unfortunately, and a throw in to come. Well, that's really strong play to keep hold of the ball. And can they make one of these passes count? Splendid tackle and a throw in coming up. It is to be a throw-in. And he stopped them in their tracks. In with a chance! Referee allowing advantage to accrue to them. In a position from which they could potentially do a bit of damage here. Throw ins given. And the referee now going back to deal with the earlier incident. A yellow card it's going to be. the flag goes up well he needs to be more aware there he didn't work hard enough to stay on side and the whistle is sounded for half time in this game well he hasn't quite had the impact and attack that we were expecting Stuart well he has to find space in more dangerous areas he's such a good player around the box but today he struggled to get on the ball and that's one of the reasons they're losing here Well, they've got things going again here, and I wonder what kind of second half we have in store for us. Oh, in with a chance! And a long way out here. Well, the keeper is happy the bar was there. Not to be advised giving the ball away there. Will he finish? And there it is! Another goal, and surely there's no way back from this now. A 
well, here's the replay. And sometimes when you've been pressed high up the field, you have to go that little bit longer and not play out through the thirds. And that's what they tried to do here. They had their pocket picked and suddenly they find the ball in the back of the net. This is looking rather comfortable for them. 3-0. Well, as you can see, he doesn't mess about here, does he? He's strong, well-balanced and skillful. That's a top-class finish. And this is turning into something of a rout. 4-0. And now with Fernandes. Hernan. It's with Alvaro. Fernandes. They've lost it. Now can they counter clinically? That's a nice looking ball. Not a time for cool heads. And he read it superbly. And he's through here. Well, just look at the defending here. The keeper is left totally exposed. It's an easy goal in the end, but well taken. Oh my goodness, it's so one-sided. 5-0 in this match. And now with Fernandes. Chetri. Fernandes. Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. Hernan. And now with Fernandes. Moving forward effectively. Shetri. Nicely timed tackle. And now with Fernandes. Could be dangerous. Well, great read there to intercept. And support available. Keeping possession of the ball with authority. Well, the conditions look pretty good for the counter-attack. And he's in. Well, here's the replay, and just look how quickly they break forward once they win the ball back. And when he gets onto it, he decides to go for power. It's a really emphatic finish, which gives the keeper no chance. It's a massive lead, and it's very hard to imagine them losing it now. 
Good use of advantage by the referee. And now with Fernandes. Getting forward. Just needs to get rid of it. Can they do something positive on the counter-attack? Defenders need to cover. And in with a real chance. Just missing narrowly on the volley. Well, it's a fantastic effort. Difficult technique, but he caught it so well. He's unfortunate. And they're making a change. Well, taking into account all the stoppages, two minutes to be added on. And making sure nothing untoward happened following the cross. Full time then, and the home side will carry with them a lead going into the second leg. Well, they were really good today. Their approach play, their movement off the ball, and of course their finishing were excellent, as was their work rate. A disciplined performance in the second leg, and they're into the final. But it just seems in this game, he's been a step ahead of his opponents in every way, Stuart. Well, he did everything today. His energy, skill and movement was just too good for those defenders. It was a really good display.